Good morning all, welcome back to the channel. We are right here in Manchester and we are getting ready for the Manchester Marathon coming up um, in a couple of hours time. We're just walking towards Old Trafford and wow, it's, what a way to kick things off of my first marathon and I'm probably the most beginner friendly marathon that um that i've heard of and um i first got this from uh, from ben park so thank you so much to ben if you're watching this for the for the inspiration it was one of his first marathons on his top 20 list that he described as very beginner friendly a very flat course um and and probably the one to gain a pb so i want to give a shout out to you ben parks for it um, uh, so yeah, we're heading towards, heading towards Old Trafford and the excitement is, is building up and as I walk, as I walk along, it's just gonna, it's just gonna keep on growing. So, I'll see you there guys! Alright guys, here we are, we just arrived here in Old Trafford Cricket Ground and we just got about 45 minutes till we head to the start line for a 10.30 start hopefully just a chat about kit here I got this Garmin H-Charm Pro dual heart rate monitor very very nice heart rate monitor now this is probably going to be one of the best things one of the highlights of my kit here, it's the Kendall Mint Hydro Pack Energy Gel Flask. Uh, I made a little homemade energy gel, um, made of coconut oil, cocoa, pa uh, cocoa powder, coffee, cinnamon, and lots of honey. It's probably going to be the best, it's going to be probably one of, the, one of the best things to take with me on this, on this race. And, Really caring for our planet right here. Uh, it has solidified a bit, so hence why I'm putting it in hot water for it to warm up. It'll all work. It'll all work out at the end. from Old Trafford to and back. It is going to be absolutely amazing. An experience to remember. All right, here we go. Let's do this guys, you got this. Mile one, oh, it's a really good pace. I kept it at zone two level. Now let's keep it at the same. Let's keep it at the same level. Round, round about the same zone, but just take it up just a little bit. Let's see if I can try and get this negative split strategy up and running. But 25.2 miles to go. Up to the next one. I smile two down. Yeah. Um, I could say I'm a little bit ahead, maybe a few more seconds ahead, but I know I need to take it easy because I know I'm aware that some beginner runners fall into the trap of going way too fast. So I should be, I should be quite happy that I've managed to maintain at a good, good, less than marathon pace. I have to pace the usual and going gradually 1% every day. As James Clear said, if you've not, have not read Atomic Habits, really good book. 
But yeah, let's go 1% every mile and let's get this done. Sorry, Ben Pax, I stole your line. Right, 5K in. One park run run down. One park run down. About seven to go, according to a spectator here. But, oh, yeah, we got this. Mile four in the back. Oh, this is the great thing about Manchester. Have a look at these towers. It's such a, it's a, it's always a, Manchester is a big, big working city. Oh, look at that, Cumbria and B, yes. Ah, oh, it's actually, yeah, it's a, it's a big city with all these glass towers here and so many workspaces. And, oh, and also a lot of Welsh people are running, are running this marathon. Some even came from like a South of Bridge End. I'm pretty sure there might be some from the North very nearby, but, oh, uh, but it's just so good to see so many people from all, all cities around coming, coming to one, coming to one great city and just giving it everything we got. But mile-wise, we're in a good spot. Again, we're gonna take a 1%. Even better. And oh, by the way, this is the only mile in this race where there's a hill ahead before the five mile mark. And then the rest is all flat. Oh, we got this. We can do this. Oh, good. <laughs> First marathon. No, oh, you too. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah, mine as well. <laughs> good luck, good luck. You too. What's your name? Katie. Katie. Mark. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Come on guys, let's cheer on for KT right here! Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Proud support here, it's absolutely incredible guiding us on this hill climb, the only hill climb of the race. And we're in here, and what better way to do this in the city centre of the great city of Manchester. Right, oh, great Manchester. Oh, we can do this. We... I got this, guys. We got this. Maybe I should take an energy gel, energy gel right now. Let's get this out. Here we go. And it's still, let's do this. Oh, trying to open this. Nice. Nice, I just <laughs> Oh, crowd support is absolutely ecstatic right here. Oh, wow, this, and now we're approaching the downhill as a reward. <laughs> oh, the finally, we get what we deserve. Heart rate is pro. And the good thing about downhills, your heart rate will go down and your speed will go up. Hopefully this will compensate, but probably maybe not go too fast. Oh, wait. This is absolutely just incredible here. Oh, Manchester, you are beautiful. Hi. Amazing people here. <laughs> hey guys! Let's <Hi>. uh, go! <laughs> right, just approaching the music section right now. Wow, amazing right here. Look at that. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Thank you.
All right, mile seven in the back. All right, there was actually one more hill we just climbed, which I actually didn't know about. The diagram on the, on the website didn't seem like a hill, but right away, we made past it. Hopefully, this might be the end of the hills, but we go. Oh, we're gonna get through this. All right, all right, another downhill. I need to take it easy. All right. I've gone, I've ran a half mile quicker than I expected. Wow. Well, and we're getting now to a steady pace. We almost reached the halfway checkpoint. Well done to the relay runners. They've now finished their race, their half marathon right here. Just well done to everyone. It wasn't easy, particularly on this course, but you all are superstars. Well done to every single one of you. I can see some of them got their medals. But we are coming to the halfway checkpoint right here. Not long to go. Not long. Here we go. Halfway. Wow. Amazing. Well done, you. Well done, everyone. Well done. Legs are tiring out, uh, but I'm not going to give up on this. We're not. We're not giving up. Everyone here is not giving up. Oh, as you can see, there's a shirt that says no one gets up behind. We, we will all complete this in whatever time we finish. It's always an achievement. We just, we just need to believe ourselves. Unfortunately, my gel solidified so it's turned but it's still eatable uh, i can still make use of it from the top but well i'm gonna keep going Make up. Oh, 19 miles in. Uh, I, oh, I really don't want to give up on this. But, uh, oh, oh, but this is running a marathon. Wow, it is certainly experience. But I have to say, Manchester is quite a deceiving marathon, given it's quite no for being beginner friendly. Oh, I just walked. Uh, well, it's um, it has a couple of hills, even at the, even at the only way down. Uh, but it has been an experience, and I think whatever time I finish, it will be, uh, it will just be incredible. But we can do this. We can, right now, let's see to some on my Spotify playlist. So hopefully this will cheer me up. Yeah. <laughs> Crowd support is amazing. As always, even to the end. Yeah. Even to the last five miles. Oh 
Well, I had to stop at the end, uh, uh, before, but it should now hopefully be all downhill. And, oh, uh, come on, come on, come on, it's almost there, almost there. Almost, almost will be done. <laughs> My quads are destroyed right now. It's so, so, wow. Running a marathon is, it is really something. And we're almost there, we're almost there. If, no matter what pace we're in, we could have finished it and we're going to feel proud of ourselves. Welcome to the finish straight, up ahead. Thank you so much. There's the finish ahead. The finish is ahead. We got this, we got this. Yeah, man. Yeah, yeah. I just got this ball from the kindness of strangers. Manchester, wow. You are absolutely incredible. It's tough. It's so hard. But uh, at one point, it really was worth it. See the finish line up ahead. It's so tough, but it's well worth it. This is what running is all about. It's so much more. It's the biggest community ever. As you can see from these people, they are so, so kind. And probably the most, and probably the most encouraging of all. And here we are. We're just approaching the village line right here, right now, in Manchester. Coming in three, in two, in one, and yes, here we go. Stop the clock. <laughs> wow. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. Well done to Steve Rees 
I honestly, oh, that was the most grueling thing of my life. I don't even know how I'm still walking. Wow, so, that is the most, well, it's grueling, but wow, thank you so much. But the end, but the ending is just, it's so, it's so surreal, no matter what the time is, those even volunteered, like this young lady right here, <laughs> wow, and now, to those who ran the marathon, to those who volunteered, honestly, I salute you for all, all you have done, for all the work you put in, whether it is, whether it went to plan or didn't, you are fantastic. Joseph is fantastic. This young lady is fantastic. Everyone here is fantastic. Yeah. Uh, but, Wow, well, uh, I need to go talk to him in the finish line. Well, right, I need to speak to my, to my parents, my family, everything. It's, wow, well, it's gonna be so good. Right guys, wow, well, I've just had a nice, very, very nice massage on my quads, hamstrings and neck. And now it's time to get back into the, back into the chair because I've been missing out on these for about for many weeks now since probably since I came back from Italy and I had like I just devoured a lot of pizza and a lot of fried foods but now it's right here along with this not this little drink right here a dinga alcohol free so I guess it's like I guess it's like an alcohol free drink but wow what has what a day this has been um it has been extremely tough. I've stitched up along the way, and it was it was probably the most grueling thing I've ever had. But one thing I can say is, it definitely has changed my life. And doing a marathon, it can it, it really changes everything. Like how much you can go further, how much like the distance you can go, and to make to prove people wrong like if you've had like limiting beliefs but this um, a marathon is a pretty more than enough way to, to to prove that and also to like show to your family and friends that anyone can do it like when they put the tra like when they put the training in and no matter how no matter how much you put in it's all about it's all about the perseverance to keep going and know that there is a like something better along the way and i want to thank everyone for supporting me throughout this throughout these like 20 weeks or so i started training in december but thank you so much to everyone uh, who supported me and thank you all to who are all to me and thank you all to who are, who are watching this please sure to subscribe to my to my channel I would do more run vlogs um, in the future. I really, really enjoy doing these, like documenting my journey, and I love seeing other people love documenting their uh, their their marathon vlogs and half marathons and any other race you you do. Good luck to anyone who's got who's got the London Marathon on the 23rd, and 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 if you've watched this after the London Marathon, very well done. And thank you so much to and um, one day maybe I might go for. London Marathon when I'm when I'm fit enough but for now thank you so much and cheers to our victory mm. 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 it's really really good that's right chef mm. this is really good all right take care guys see, see you in the next one